Should there be a military draft? If not, should there be a civil service draft? And I, I mean civilian service, which requires every young person to do something for their country while these 200,000 people are putting their lives at risk. I would support uh, a, a, a military draft. Uh, I don't think I'd support a civil service requirement. I'd promote a civil service requirement. I will never support a draft. Having been a child of the 60s and 70s, I saw what the draft did to the poor and, uh, and, and less fortunate of this country. Uh, I would, however, and I've been for years, calling for a system along the way that Germany does it, uh, which is a broad-based civilian draft. Every child at the age of give or take 18, when they, when they graduate high school, have to give a year. Most of them do choose military service, and that's a fine way to do it. Uh, others choose other services to do but it. But mandatory. You choose one or the other, but you choose mandatory. one or the other for one year that everybody across the board knows. Please. I think what we need to do is fund the volunteer army, provide for the training, make sure that we fund the National Guard. Let's focus on creating a good, strong volunteer army, National Guard, that allows for opportunities for career and education. We have an alt-volunteer force. It's the most effective fighting force in the world. We don't need it. We don't need a civilian service draft. Either. Look, you don't need to force people. You just need to fund it.